Alright guys, welcome back to more Let's Play Demon Souls. We are in a, uh, we're in a new, new save file. Um, I am a, uh, knight in this one. Uh, if you saw the Red Dragon video, that explains everything. We're going more for, like, an even-based, um, stat spread. Uh, I do have to, like, increase a couple of them a bit more than I have, but... I wanted to get a bit more, like, hit points and uh, defense and stuff. So, um, what we're going to do is, so we still have, you know, we have the entire next section of Boletaria. Uh, we, we are done with that, except for maybe a few miscellaneous items to pick up. Uh, Tower of Latria, we have Maneater and the boss after that. Uh, we're done with that one, minus any miscellaneous items. And then we have Astraea in there to pick up. Um, however, our tendency is uh, pure white, it seems. And I have done, I, I had to do a little bit of research to understand like what the hell I need to do. Um, so, it, within this playthrough, I've done so well, and I haven't really died in Boletaria, that the front gate is now open. Which is exciting. I get to know what's behind there now. Oh, I still have to, like, get Lord Rydal's stuff in the tower. I also need to get the tower's tendency to be higher. So if we come over here... I'm gonna first kill this guy. That's better. I'm also gonna turn down my TV real quick. Okay, so if we come over here, the gate is now open. There are some items. I think there's even a um, a lizard guy. So this is going to be fun. What items are we going to get here? Somebody coming after us? Any items here? No. I will also uh, have to show off something else as well when uh, when we get to it, but we're gonna, we're going to deal with this first. Oh, I'm actually surprised there isn't like an item right here. Oh, hi! I don't know where you came from. Well, that was. Wow, okay. I don't know why you existed. Like, hello? Why, why do these guys exist right now? Like, they're kind of worthless. Okay, unknown soldier's soul. Another one. I think, oh, the, the guy fell off, damn it. The lizard fell off the cliff. I wanted his items. Okay, so what do I do? Like, is this literally just to get a couple of random items occasionally? Oh, that's a guillotine. Or guillotine, actually. Hello! Wow. Got him. Okay. I mean, I... T hmm. What if I... What if I go up here? Can I, like, climb up here? No. I guess not. Well, how many how many crosses is this? One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Hmm. Let's uh let's switch my stuff around. There. Oh, 
Oh, we're gonna be under the, uh... Yeah, under that thing. Ow! Okay. I've done nothing to the king. Ow. This woman, this woman hits hard. There we go. She has a cool weapon, though. What else do, oh, I have the mace. Well, the mace doesn't really seem to do much of anything. Oh, she's wearing an executioner's hood? That's awesome. Okay, well, she's clearly gonna die. <laughs> binded hood, binded cross, binded gloves, boots, and master's ring. Okay, uh, hold on, where's my inventory? Here we go. Pointed hat which covers the entire head is made of leather and scraps of cloth. They are worn by executioners, especially Executioner Meralda, who was known for her lunacy and beautiful voice. Well, definitely loon. Um, okay, and I think all of those are female only, it said. Yeah. So we can't wear them, but we can have them. Oh, and then we got a master's ring. Do we already have one of those? I do. Okay, so I can deposit one of those. That's awesome. Okay. I was not expecting a boss fight immediately. Okay. So, we have dead end. And here's the stairs. Ring of poison resistance, that's nice. Okay. All right. <laughs> hmm. Okay, so in order for me to get to that, oh, that's, mm, okay, so hold on, is there an item, I'm going to go all the way down real quick, so that item is a thing that exists, this just seems very far to, uh, to try and fall down onto that from, but it's probably going to be, like, a stupidly good item. Okay. So let's get rid of the Thief's Ring and add the... Where is it? Uh, Herculean. And... Okay, so that's another Poison Resistance Ring that we have. Brushwood leggings, brushwood gauntlets, brushwood armor, brushwood helmet. It is a. This old helmet was long ago held by the Boletarian royal family, excellent for staving off flame. Bureau of the Twins Fangs has been known for wearing it, heaviness, blah 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 blah. That's better than the fluted. Uh for wearing. So, that might actually end up, uh... So I'll probably start wearing that, which means I'm going to need to equip, uh, increase my, like, equip, uh, load better. Okay. I thought I could, I thought it was going to be shallow. Don't tell me that's going to be forever closed now. I thought that was going to be shallow. Oh, please tell me it stays open. Yes, it's still open. Awesome. Alright, I can go back and get my souls. Oh, I'll also grab whatever that is. I'm going to use that one late, one half moon grass. Uh, but I should have a stone eye, right? Yes. I knew I kept one on me. 
We do have like ten stone eyes or something in storage. Like that's how well I've been doing in this playthrough. Is oh. And I can't... Uh, fine. I'll just do this. Got him. I don't know what I picked up, but I'll take it. Yeah, no, that's fine. <sighs> These all just gonna drop crescent moon grasses? Because, I mean, that's fine. Alright, three people died there. And then five people up here. Yeah. Oh no. It's like the weakest people, too. Like, nothing that's really going to be a challenge. Alright, let's use a couple of these. Okay. She shouldn't be here because I killed her. And she's not. Good. Okay. So I could walk out here. Which... That doesn't really go out that far. Whereas, like, walking out from here would be better... My souls are down there. Oh, boy. Hmm. Like, I want to know what that item is. But I also don't want to die. So that might be a thing I do when I have a lot more hit points. <laughs> like, I'm not going to risk it. I mean... What's, what? I could attempt. Like, honestly, there could be an attempt where I would try landing on that. And if I miss, I fall all the way to the floor, which until I have a better, safer landing, that's probably going to be death. So I'm not going to risk it. There's no point in going over there. I don't even know why I did. And then I just thought that that right there was, you know, walkable. Alright, regain my blood. Or my souls. We'll climb back up. It's not much in terms of souls, but every little bit helps. Alright, and this is just going to take a while. This isn't as bad, uh, this isn't as long as, uh, Snake Eater. But this is kind of long. Yeah, that's, I mean, that is so out of the way and so dangerous to get to that it's got to be something good. Like, that's just my thinking. Like, if that's just, like, a crescent moon grass, that's going to be really annoying. Okay, so we are out of there, and that, I mean, other than that one item, uh, I guess that's it for this gated area. So, um, there is something else that I had done off camera, and I didn't even realize I was doing it until after I had done it. So what we're going to do is we're going to head back to the Nexus. Real quick. Because I'm also going to, like, change my armor around and stuff. If I can. Yes. Okay. So, if we come over here... Um... I have a woman. That I did not have in the previous playthrough. Uh, her name is Yuria. And so, what you want to do 
And the first thing that I want to do is I want to get rid of the female armor since I can't use that. Thank goodness. Um, so we'll deposit the female, which is the binded. Okay. Now I do want to see... So brushwood, 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 brushwood. Oh, my equip burden is is uh, too much. Okay. So because my equip burden is too much, I will keep with the fluted, but I will deposit the brushwood. Okay, so we will... Yeah, I can still at least do that. So we'll deposit the brushwood. And at least we have it. Okay. Wait. So, uh, Yuria, the woman. Oh, why, why'd I leave? Thank goodness. Throughout Boletaria's third act, so after the Tower Knight, before the Penetrator, um, you will end up killing a, like, Jester guy that will end up having a official's cap. Um, so, uh, like, all of those, all of those wizards guys that, like, shoot fire. So, if you come, so if you warp to the Tower Knight, Archstone, and then you, um, if you go towards the locked gate, is what I'm trying to think of. So I'll, I'll show you exactly where you go. Because uh, I didn't even realize uh, that I was doing it until I did it. Um... And I did look up the how to get the thing, uh, how to get to the location, uh, mainly because I wanted to be able to actually uh, get every spell and every miracle. Yeah, that's fine. Damn dog. Okay. So, uh, if you open up this area. Come down here. Or no, not this one. It's the other aisle. There. Alright. And you know, you follow you follow these steps and stuff. Turn the corners. You open here. And then you have this tower. So there was, there was like a drawbridge at the very top of the tower that I just, I couldn't figure out how to get down, like get done, uh, and have it lower so that we could get up there. So if we come up here, the, the drawbridge is lower, it's that guy. He will only lower it, uh, if you are wearing a, uh, the, the, the official's cap, or whatever it is, the one that I showed you. Uh, he will only lower it if you're wearing that. And then when he lowers it, you now have access to up here. In which up here was sitting, uh, the Lady Yoria. In which... Nice, we killed him. I'll take a new moon grass, thank you. In which, uh, right over here was sitting Yoria. And then you can rescue her, and then she'll start teaching you spells. So I figured I'd show that, because that ended up happening, uh, off camera. I wasn't even recording video. I was just, you know grinding through uh, all the bosses that we've already fought. Um, so, that's everything that I can remember. Uh, we killed the dragon, but I showed that in, in a separate video. Um, we rescued Yuria, which I just showed you how to do. And uh, we just defeated a uh, executioner, which that was actually pretty fun. Get out of here. So, um... Also, uh, I guess something else to, to mention, uh, whatever his name is, Ostrava of Boletaria, the guy that you rescue near the original Thief's Ring, uh, he is still alive in this playthrough, and we're going to end up, you know, seeing him sometime, I guess. Uh, so, I think what I'm going to do is off camera, I'm going to kill these people here, uh, just for the hell of it, and when we come back, we're going to do something. So, thanks for watching, guys, and I will see you then.